I wrote this song so many times that after I had called the police, I found it on the Because when I was on the beach, it was my time to sing. Some days I don't want to go to bed. I don't want to open my eyes because the second I do, I will all start. I think my name for cruelty. My face of these stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me. That is true. I would rather have broken bones than listen to the words that you say, because they do hurt. But why do I have to get out of bed to a world that doesn't feel, a world that doesn't comprehend it all? I don't hear the pain inside when the words, yes, I'm fine. I don't hear it, I don't hear it when someone stabs a knife into me. Better yet, a mason? I hear it when you smile at and make something happy. Do that as if happiness is a choice. It's not. If I could feel happy like you, yes, I would, but I can't. What I do feel is the hot tears that stream down my face as you tell me to ignore it, cuts through me like the razor blades that tear through my skin, as if the blood pouring out were just the words. I don't. I watch the flames heat up and flicker in the darkness. The darkness is being faded with each breath. I'm telling you that the pain of all this stems out the pain of the society that we live in today. The state of mind it doesn't come in waves and waves. It's like tsunamis. Sometimes I'm not even sure why these feelings are sudden. It's like a light switch. On, off, on, off. You can't help. Why? What gave it away the help was me? Was it the thought that in this world we live in, someone will attempt to suicide once every day? And someone will complete suicide once every 17 years? What if you found one of these people? The one minute, the 17 minute. What if someone one of the 2,000 people that we lost to his every single day. What if you found a body, lifeless, hanging, feet lifted high above the ground and rope tied around his neck? Would you take your words back? Even if you had never said a thing, would you feel sorry? Would you? I hope you would. I want all of you here tonight to remember words will break bones that should walk. We will put bottles of pills in mouths that should read and speak freely. We will put knives, blades, and lighters to skin that was not made to harm. And they will put ropes around necks and lives of one who was made to live. So watch what you say. We are all fighting a battle that you know nothing about. Keep in mind that words do kill. They have and they will. Time to realize the importance of being that someone is in the same place. Even that someone is save lives. We can make a difference. We can lower suicide rates and we together can break the stigma. Today we speak up and today we speak out on mental health. 